Alright, <clears throat> what's going on YouTubers? Just playing a little Dark Souls. This time I'm using my class build level 50. I know a lot of people that cap their characters at level 50 and... I have one of my buddies help me out here getting through uh, the Duke's archive and dealing with Seath Scalus. I went mainly with a. Uh, I'm rocking an intelligence build, so I'm mainly a caster. My buddy here, he's using a dexterity build, I believe. That's why he is doing so awesome with the sword he is using. Yeah, the game. The game can be really challenging when you're trying to. A lot of people challenge me to do a soul level one. I just can't do it. I, I'll, I'll go to 50, cap 50, and try to beat the game. Ah, the Crystal Cave. I say this is an area that I know a lot of people just rage quit this game over. Is finding these in, invisible. Uh, bridges and being able to successfully uh, navigate them like right before I was uh, started this clip I was on a uh, d just died I fell off the bridge myself it's just so easy to do see seeing the messages floating around that's one of the handiest things in the game is smart players that will let you know uh, put messages down on these invisible bridges and that that really will help you out versus playing offline if you play offline mode you wouldn't see any of these messages you'd be like you'd have a really hard time trying to navigate that right here I'm just looking for my shit I, I died and oh, I just spotted it right below me my 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 humanity and souls In that area I just passed, there's a there's another invisible bridge. If you go through, uh, kill a couple of the, the crystal slugs, as I call them, or titanite slugs, or whatever, you can get a uh, titanite uh, slab. Oh, I think it's a white titanite slab or blue titanite slab. Now these clams, oysters or whatever, they they have a good drop, drop in the crystal chunks. I should have had my ring on to get it off all of them, but right here I'm just getting a little sloppy. Thinking I have my crystal weapon casted on my weapon and switching out of it. <clears throat> my buddy here, he's doing all the real damage. I get a, I finally use a heavy spell right at the end. But yeah, these things are really good for farming. Then my good buddy Seath the Scalus. I think we made this look real easy at level 50. Kind of just plowing right through him. <laughs> yeah, getting cursed. A lot of people end up getting cursed by him, and if you don't have uh, the purging stone, you're you're just pretty much screwed. If you get cursed, you have to go get a purging stone.
one surefire way I always take them out is you all, always, no matter what, first thing you gotta do is go break um, uh, whatever th this rod that makes them immortal. I don't know how many times I've forgotten to do this. Break that. <coughs> Just focus on his right, his right tentacle, I guess you would say. But he's behind him, so he's kind of doing that attack all, hit everybody attack. Yeah, that, that's so effective, just <clears throat> going right after this kind of right here. Catch you YouTubers later. Add some more videos soon here.